wow wow <laughs> okay you can see that is super pigmented absolutely wow are you ready i'm not ready i'm not ready hi guys i know it's been a minute it's been a minute i'm really sorry but i'm back um and this is gonna be my first ever makeup video yeah without further ado i just want to get straight into it and show you guys what i'm here to talk about this is the brand new kami make magic palette i am so excited just have a look at this oh my days imagine what we can create with this imagine how many looks we can create with this let's start with the these shades so we've got 14 shades here that are just like your average like mattes with a few shimmers and then we've got this top row let's talk about this for a second oh wow yes i think it's i think they're supposed to be a few of them are pour poured poured a few of them are poured um and i haven't touched this palette yet so i am gonna touch it now and show you guys what why it's called make magic okay let's let's just go there so let's go for this one Ooh. also it comes with a mirror um which is amazing because like it's good to have a stiff mirror so that you can kind of put your palette down and like do your makeup and dip back into your shades which is really lovely let's touch money maker this one Oh my gosh, this one has been calling my name. Really? Oh, wow. Wow. Let's do a swatch. Oh my days. Wow. Okay, Kami Revolution, you've outdone yourselves. Love this. Look at the shimmer on that. Another shade that's been calling my name is You Got This. This one here. It's got like a brown and a blue in, so I'm really excited to try that. Let's have a swatchy swatch. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, I'm done. This is the only palette I'm ever gonna need ever again. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Okay, um, so a few of the shades that stand out to me in this palette. Um, I love what's happening down here in this corner. I love this colour story here and this green one here is a shimmer. So I feel like these might create something really fun. I love the colour story that's going on over here as well. This is really sweet. This is like a autumny, burgundy kind of thing going on here love that i also feel like these four create a really nice color story together that's a look waiting to happen and then obviously you've got your top row where you can kind of dip into these to create looks and then add your shimmer add your extra pop of something something you know summer summer yeah so i'm gonna go off camera now do my base for my eyes um and and then we're gonna go ham on this we're gonna go ham this is the one we're going in we're going in guys right i'm back i've got my tape on i've done my brows and i've put some prime and lock on my eyelids so i just used the revolution pro brow duo powder in the shade dark brown to do my brows and i just went over my brows with the conceal and define concealer in the shade 12.5 and I used my pro brush 100 just to make sure it was all sharp I'm still learning how to do brows and on camera this one looks a lot thicker than that but in real life I mean it's a learning curve literally curve <laughs> I went on to my lids really quickly using the prime and lock from revolution which is really great for eyeshadow and getting it all to stick onto your lids. So now, <laughs> let's dive into the palette. I think, I don't know which shade to go for first. I think I need a transition shade and this is kind of like the lightest one. 
and I definitely want to get this colour on my eye as well. So we're going to go in with Addicted, which is the light one, and we're just going to do above the crease to make sure everything blends out really nicely. And I'm going to use the mirror in my new Kami palette. <laughs> Let's tap into that. I'm also using the Pro Brush 150, just to go in with. Okay, okay. So, mirror. <laughs> Okay, wow. I thought that was going to be too light for me, but actually it's a really nice transition colour. You can just see it there. I already love this. Love it. Really nice formula. Goes on really easily. So yeah. Let's just do the other side. This is actually my perfect transition shade. I'm so impressed. I thought it was going to be really light, but it's actually coming out really nicely. It's just like a, almost a skin tone kind of transition shade. I'm just using a small brush. I should probably get a fluffier brush for this. So I'm just going to use this brush. It's a fluffier brush from... Um, my Revolution brush kit. I'm going to go into the same shade, Addicted, and I'm just going to fluff that out. Oh yeah, that's that's the brush I needed, definitely. I can't believe this palette is only £10. That blows my mind, literally. Okay, so I'm happy with that. Um, and now I'm going to go in with, let's go in with Overcome as like my lid shade, this one. Really, really nice. I'm going to use the same brush because I'm one of those girls who likes to use the same brush. I don't think you need 10,000 brushes to create a really nice eye look. Wow. Okay. This color is so beautiful. Even on the brush, you can see it's super pigmented. It's just, yeah, you can see that it's super pigmented. Absolutely. Wow. Are you ready? I'm not ready. I'm not ready. Okay. Okay. Wow. Love that color. <gasps> that is like summer perfection. Who's ready for summer? We are. <laughs> Just gonna fluff that just like slightly above my crease so I have really hooded eyes as well so all my makeup is basically gonna be designed for people with super hooded eyes as you can see when I like do that my lids just disappear so I'm hoping that I can get some really good results from this palette for hooded eyes wow I love this color super warm super do you know what? This is like a really good summer and a really good autumn shade. That's what we like. We like as a palette that can do both. When I blend this into the shade Addicted, so I'm using Overcome and Addicted, it creates the nicest blend. Can you, you can't really see where one starts and where one ends. That is so nice. I just need to sort this bit out here. Fluff it a little bit more. Wow. Loving this look already. I could go out like this. <laughs> I could do it. I could rock this look. I feel confident in these colours. Okay, let's do the other eye. This is a really gorgeous, like, buildable colour as well. I'm feeling this. So I am totally happy with this blend. I'm happy with the colours. I feel like it's quite neutral, but I'm going to spice it up with this palette. Oh! So now I'm going to go in with that shade that I really wanted to use, called You Do You. 
this one and I'm just going to use the same brush that I was using before which is the 150 the one that I changed from when I was doing addicted and I'm just going to do the V shape and go a little bit up into my crease oh love this color yes oh my god this is like the chocolatiest brown I've ever used wow and it's super pigmented I can tell straight away just by looking at the brush ready I'm nervous <laughs> oh my gosh look at that immediate color payoff I feel like I'm going for an autumn look here but I'm gonna make it a bit more Actually, no, I'm quite happy with it being an autumn-y kind of nice brown. This is like a really good night out kind of look, I guess. We're just winging it. I'm just playing with the palette so far. Absolutely love this colour. This is like a, I could wear this on its own kind of colour. Look at that. Look at that. We're done. We're done here. Wow. Wow. Oh my gosh, Kami, Revolution, yes. Okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> Can we just take a second to appreciate the goddess vibes I'm getting right now? This is literally the perfect brush as well for getting right into the V and into the crease. As I said, I've got like super hooded eyes so you can see like it's really easy for me to kind of cut things out and define. You can see it's created like a really nice depth on my eyes as well. <laughs> and also, look how pigmented it is. I've hardly used the colour. You can't even see that I've used it. Like you tap into it and it's just... This is saturated, but this looks untouched until you get real close. <laughs> you can't even see. You can't even see. And I mean, this is a pretty good camera, so let's just buff that out a bit more. Get a bit more shade on there. This is like the deepest chocolatiest colour I've ever used. So I'm going to go back in now with my brush from my Revolution kit and I'm just going to buff that all out. Wow, Kami and Revolution got me feeling like a goddess. A oh, yes. Love this. Let's just take a closer look. Okay, beaut. So I don't know whether to cut the crease or not, um, cause I, like I said, I've got massive hooded eyes. So cutting the crease is like, takes most of it away. But I think just for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna do it. Why not? So I'm using Cut Crease Canvas by Revolution and I'm using this in the shade Illustrate. This is the fairest one that they do and the reason I use the lightest one is just because I feel like it helps the colours like really pop when I put them on top of it. So I'm going to show you guys how I use it. You can go straight in with the applicator but I prefer to use my Pro Brush in 100 just to make sure everything is smooth and seamless and I feel like I get a bit more control. So I just place a bit of the product on the back of my hand. And honestly, you don't need to go back into it. Once you've dipped in, that's enough for like both eyes right there. So I'm just gonna use my my beautiful palette mirror and I'm gonna tap this on the inside near my eyelashes and then I'm gonna look up and look around. Look up, look around, done, done. <laughs> Now I'm gonna just take the excess off of my brush and just kind of like create that really nice circular. I'm just gonna basically fill it in. It's like coloring in guys. So what I don't wanna do is remove all of the 
shadow that I've put on so what I'm gonna do is I'm, you can see I've got super hooded eyes it's just all disappears but we gotta work with it we gotta work with it so I'm actually gonna create a bit more of a cut with my brush because I get a lot of control with this brush and also the cut crease canvas creates like a really nice sticky base so that eyeshadows can stick and I'm just gonna create a nice there bring it up to the eyeshadow and now I'm gonna go in with the brush that I used for the um, the brush that I used with UDU and I'm just gonna buff out the end of the cut crease So you can see what I've done there is I've created like a seamless finish to the cut crease and I've also decided on like a kind of like an angled shape to apply on top of the cut crease. Perfect! Okay so what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to finish the other eye and then I'm going to come back and we're going to dive into the top layer! So I've done both eyes now, I've cut the crease on both eyes um, and yeah we're going to dive straight into this top layer, look at these colours, oh my gosh, yes, I am obsessed with You Got This, I am also obsessed with Money Maker, I want to go in with both of those and I feel like they will complement each other, I'm going to use my finger for You Got This and I'm going to go use that on the kind of in the, the middle part of my eye and then I'm going to try and get money maker on the inner corner but I'm going to have to use a brush because I've got these nails on and it's not going to let me get into the inner corner without ruining this eye look and I am obsessed so let's do it oh, you got this right we're going in with this shade first we're going to do this one on the middle of the lid and I'm going to use this finger Oh, it's really soft. The formula is really soft and you don't need to press hard at all. Can you see that? Wow. It's like a chrome blue and brown. I'm ready. I've zoomed you guys right in so you can see. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Wow. This is so nice. Oh my gosh. I'm in love. This is by far my favorite, favorite shade. I haven't even touched half the other ones and I'm like, this is the one. This is the one, wow. Oh my gosh, this is like eyeshadow perfection right now. I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't ready. I was not ready. Wow. Guys, look at that. Oh my gosh. This is insane. Who is she? Who is she? <laughs> Let's move on. <laughs> if we can, we cannot. So now I'm going to take Money Maker, which is this gorgeous gold that we swatched at the beginning, and I'm going to take the Pro 130 brush, and I'm going to try and get that on my inner corner. Super soft formula. Let me just show you guys. Super soft. Definitely picks up on the brush really well. I'm not ready. Do it. Oh my gosh it's like i've been kissed by gold this is so nice can we <laughs> i can't i'm gonna try and like drag the gold up a little bit into the crease just to create like a really nice This is like all kinds of giving me life right now. 
Kami. Can you imagine what you can create with this palette? Look at that. Oh my gosh, this is gonna look so nice when I've got my lashes on. I'm gonna do a black wing as well. Oh, this chrome shade. Ah! Okay, I've done the other eye. I am obsessed with this palette. This is so different to anything I've used. There's like, I can see why it's called Make Magic. Just like the possibilities in, in this one palette is insane because the formulas of these are completely different at the top as well. So this one, um, I'm, I'm not familiar with like the types of formulas or anything, but they're so different. And I think this is like a, I could throw my whole collection away and just live on this palette. Uh, obviously I'd keep my Tammy palette because I absolutely love that palette. If I have to recommend getting a palette for like the next six months of your life and you're traveling, this is the one. You can create a day look, you can create a night out look, you can create like, I'm going to a wedding, you can create, I'm a goddess, you can create Instagram makeup. Look at this. How can you argue? You can't argue with this. Um, I'm gonna go in now with my fav, 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 favorite eyeliner, liquid eyeliner. This is the Renaissance Flick by Revolution. So I'm just gonna put my finger in here. It helps that I've got nails on. But I'm just gonna use like that point that I've created with my finger and I'm just gonna clean up underneath my eyes. Okay, I think I'm happy with that. I'm just gonna go back in with my Renaissance flick and I'm gonna add in the bits that are missing. eyeshadow is consistent on both sides I love it and I've also noticed there's no crease in which is unusual for my giant hooded eyes that hide all of the makeup I put on them so finally to finish off the eyes before I go in and do all of my base um, I'm gonna go in with the brush that I use the one the 150 if it wants to focus ever and I'm just gonna go under my eyes with what's on it. Now I'm just gonna finish off my base and then I'll be right back to show you guys the final look. Hi guys, I'm back. Um, we've zoomed out a little bit. The beat is complete. What do you think? I'm feeling good. Like, I'm ready to go out and hit up London. <laughs> like, good. So, my final thoughts on this palette, uh, invest. This has been one of the most amazing palettes that I've used in a long time. Um, apart from my Tammy palette, I do really love my Tammy palette. Um, I keep mentioning it, I should probably just show it to you. The two newest collaboration palettes from Revolution, we've got the Tammy Carnival palette. If you guys want to see more of that, head over to my Instagram. You can see a look I created with that. And also follow Tammy on Instagram. There are so many amazing photos from the launch. And then this, this bad boy, the one shining, the one we love. This is the one that I've used to create this look, which is just insane. This is a really easy palette to create amazing looks with if your makeup skills are like zero to one from zero to a hundred you can create so many good looks in this palette i am literally obsessed i just think this has been one of my favorite makeup looks that i've created in a very very long time i totally love the name of this palette i think the packaging is absolutely awesome love the different textures up here love the different outcomes love the chrome love 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 Think of all the things you spend £10 on when you could be just like owning this palette. <laughs> and also 
the first, the very first shade is called Cause of You, which Kami has said in his launch video that he named for his BBs, which are his fans, his followers, people who appreciate, admire and support him. Um, so yeah, he was saying that this palette wouldn't be possible without you guys, without people supporting the palette, without people supporting Kami. So Cause of You is the first shade and I really love that shade. It's like a really nice peachy shade. This is like perfect for spring. The colour story going on up here. We've got another one here. There's just so many, so many possibilities. So I'm looking forward to like diving deeper into this um, and creating more looks. Thank you guys for watching another video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to follow me, all of my details are in my comment description description box everything's in the description box if you want to follow me on instagram and twitter that would be amazing i'd really appreciate your support um yeah don't forget to like if you like hate if you hate cami's foot cami's words oh my God. so yeah don't forget to like my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the bell if you want to be notified when i do more videos and let me know most importantly what you think of this beat and if you enjoyed me doing a makeup video so that I can do more for you in the future. Thanks for joining. Mwah.